what's up there we have a question that we are going to deal with in this tutorial about linear equation for more and this question was uh, tested during the KCSE of year 2018 paper 1 number 16 and the question goes like this a two digit number is such that the sum of its digits is 13 when the digits are interchanged the original number is increased by 9. Find the original number. So in this question, we are going to understand the place value of these digits. But first of all, we have to assume the digits. Because we are told the number is a two-digit number. And when the number are put together or they are undent, the answer is 13 and when they are interchanged the original number is increased by 9 then you are supposed to find the original number 4 max so if we were to look at this question in details and if we let the numbers or the number let number be x y so this means that if i take this digit x plus y i should have 13 because that is what the information that we are given when the number the digits are interchanged what does this mean we shall have y x If we have y x then we are told that y x is equivalent to x y plus 9 I think that is the simple uh, way of defining it two digit number x y is such that when its digits are and then it's 13 x plus y is equals 13 when the digits are interchanged now it was x y now we have y x the original number which is x y is increased by 9 find the original number so we know that if we try to remember the the information or the knowledge that we have of natural numbers in the original number, y takes the place value of 1s and x the place value of 10s. In the interchanged uh, digit, x takes the values of 1s, the place value of 1s, and the other one the place value of 10s. So if I may give an example of natural numbers or of actual numbers, for example, if we have a uh, 68 we have six tenths and eight units if we have a number like uh, 17 this means we have one tenths and seven units so this is the information that you are going to use in order for us to solve this kind of problem so what we are going to do in this case there therefore we shall say that because this is the the interchanged uh, digits and therefore this is the new number in this new number we have 10 y's and we have x units and this one is equivalent to the original number that we and 10 X and Y unit but remember when the number was interchanged from the information that we have the original number is increased by 9 so this one is increased by 9 so the two equation the the, the two signs of the equation are now balancing because this is nine more than the original number so this is nine more 
than the original number. I want to believe so far, so good. If we may proceed, therefore, if we put like terms together, we shall have 10y. If it closes the equal sign, sign, then we have minus y. And then we have 10x. If it closes the equal sign, we shall have minus x plus 9. So this one we shall have 9y is equals to 9x plus 9. Okay. So if I bring the unknown values to one side of the equation, therefore, what shall I have? I shall have 9y minus 9x is equivalent to 9. If I proceed again, yeah, looking at it, yeah, we are fine. Maybe we can have, I think 9 is common. So if I factor it out, we shall have y minus x is equals 9. Okay, if I divide both sides of equation by 9, then I shall have y minus x is equals 1. Now, looking at this equation, we have formed two equations. And there was the original equation. So, what comes to my mind is the two simultaneous equations that I'm going to solve to get the value of x and y. Because both equations have x and y as the unknown. So I'm going to use substitution method. If I make y the subject and the x crosses the other side, we shall have 1 plus x. Now, if we substitute, if we substitute a y with 1 plus x in the first equation, what shall we have? So we shall have x plus 1 plus x x is equals 13 and therefore we shall have 2x plus 1 is equals 13 and therefore 2x is equals if it crosses the other sign it shall be negative and therefore it will be 12 if i divide by 2 and i divide by 2 on the other side therefore x x shall be equals to to 6 so the value of x in this case is 6 now substituting again substituting y we are told that y is equals 1 plus x now substituting x with the 6 we shall have y as 7 therefore what does this mean remember our original original number was x y so the value of x here is 6 and the value of y is 7 so the original number is 67 so it's very easy to score your four marks if you have the knowledge of natural numbers especially the place varies you have to break it down into ones and tens so that you are able to solve such uh, problems it's a bye god bless you